Okay, what we'd like to do now is to show you some lead up drills to teach the numbered fast break for the junior high coach. And, and we do these drills every day in practice. Uh, usually go for about 10 minutes and we run about six drills. Uh, and I think they're a must. I think you have to do them. These are the ones that in order for you to get the finished product, you've got to be able to do these drills. So gentlemen, let's get into the three man break. Three man break. Okay, now one of the points that we're going to try to teach on this three-man break is that uh, uh, coach, get out, get out front here, and you kind of get your hands up when they come in. All right, kind of get your hands up, but I don't want you to hit them. I don't want you to hit them. All right. So they've got to concentrate on that basket. Concentrate on the basket. Okay, let's go, gentlemen. Here we go. Move it. Good. Straight up. Good. 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 Up. Good. Nice job, Patrick. Good job. Nice job. Set, Brad. Good. Run it. Hands. Get those hands ready. Hands. Good job, Matt. Hands. Hang on, Patrick. Good. Bring her back. Quick. Good. Move it. Move it. Up. Up. Good. 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 Run. Good. Good. Move. Get those hands ready. Okay, good job, gentlemen. This particular drill, what we try to do, we get the pass to the guy on the side, He's going to take it in for a layup, but the guy who threw him the ball is going to chase him. He's going to hear footsteps. He's going to hear footsteps. One of the teaching points that we want on this particular drill is I tell the kids, we don't want you to broad jump. And we'll show you what I mean by broad jump. Get out here, Jube. Okay? And what I want you to do is to take off from here, Jube, and kind of just go at the basket. Do you understand? All right, let's go. Okay, that's kind of the broad jump, okay? What I want the kids to do is the high jump. You high jump at the basket. Go straight up, and the shot, we always tell our kids, we want the shot to come here. You'll see a lot of kids that'll like to scoop the ball. We don't like that. We want it up here because we think we've got a better chance of contact than getting fouled. Too easy to block the shot from down here. Okay, this time, let's high jump now, Jube. High jump, buddy, high jump. Good, nice job, and he finishes up. Good job. All right, gentlemen, let's run that layup with Chaser right now. Let's go. Run it. Hear those footsteps, Patrick. Here he comes. Good job. Good job. Hear the footsteps, Murph. Concentrate. Good job. Set. All the way. Footsteps. Oh, almost a block. Block it, train. Here we go. Oh, almost. Here we go. Run it. Good job, Tyler. Good job. Run it. Excellent, Juber. Excellent. It's all right, Case. Here we go. Run it. Good. Good. Up. Good. Good. One more. Good job. Hold her up. Next drill. Gentlemen, I want you underneath the basket. Coaches, I need you there, each with ball. We're gonna go uh, rebound outlet. Rebound outlet drill. The dr what we're trying to teach on this particular one, when they get the ball, we want them to chin the basketball, okay? How many times in a basketball game have you seen somebody get the rebound and then someone will knock the ball out of their hands, especially in grade school. So what we'd like to do, we want them to chin the ball, elbows out, now the ball, the hands come up, double hand pump, and we hit the outlet man right now. So we're gonna go through that drill uh, down here at this particular end, uh, rebound with outlet, okay? Let's go, okay? Chin it, chin it, chin it, good. Chin it, up, up, chin it. Up, chin it. You can throw it against the board, right? Good. You can shoot it. Good. Chin it. Up. Good. Nice job, Tyler. 
Good job. Up, Matt. Good. Excellent, Matt. Excellent. Good. Up. Shin it. Up. Excellent. Good. Up. Good. Up. Good. Up. Good. Up. Good. Up. Good. Good. Okay, hold it up now. This is probably one of our favorite drills, okay? Make or miss, the ball cannot touch the floor. If the ball touches the floor, the kid automatically goes over to the side and he does five push-ups. The ball cannot touch the floor. If we make it, make it this time, Ryan. We'll grab it, Brad. He's out of bounds. He throws it. He's back in bounds. Next one. Shoot it. Let's go. Okay. Make it. Miss it. Up. Boards. Grab it. All right. Okay. Now, we, this particular time, we were just warming up. Brad said that wasn't fair, coach. All right, now we're ready to go, and we're going to start Brad in there in the middle. And what I usually tell the coach, try to make two, miss one. Then we'll get the next guy in there, okay? And then after Brad, I want Josh. We always want our four and five men doing this drill. So we'll get Josh, we'll get Stacy, and we'll get Patrick in there, okay? Let's go. All right, run it. Good. Up. He grabs it. Good. Nice out of bounds. Good job. He's back in there. Move it. Grab it. Again. Good. Run. Good. Up. Grab it. Outlet. Good. All right. Next guy. Let's go. That's a good job, Brad. That's a good job. Grab it. Whoa. Josh is over there on the side. Get in there, Matt. Josh is doing those push-ups. Let's go. Grab it. Outside. Good. Good. Get back in there. Move. Grab it. Good. Let's go. That's excellent, Matt. That's a good job, Matt Stacy. That, the last one, we didn't get the ball up here, though. We got to get that ball up here for the outlet. All right, let's go. Run it. Come on, Patrick. Come on, Patrick. Grab it. Good. Nice outlet, Pat. Good. Up. Good. Gra oh, Patrick's over there doing those layups. Let's go. We got uh, Josh back in there. Let's go. Here we go. Don't let it go through, Josh. Don't let it go through. Easy. Good. Grab it. Get there. Get there. Grab it. Good. Get there. Good. Up. Grab it. Outlet. Good. Nice job, gentlemen. Very good job. Last two drills that we're going to do, up, lead up drills to the fast break. Or first is the figure eight. Uh, and in this particular drill, the ball never touches the floor. If the ball does touch the floor, kids realize they've got five push-ups that they do. If it touches once going up and once coming back, then they get 10 push-ups. So most of the time, they work at this really hard. Point of emphasis, we want the kids' hands to be ready. How many times have you seen the point guard hit a big kid with, uh, in the hands and he drops the ball? And I have a philosophy, the hands are not ready. So make sure those hands are ready. You're going to hear me yelling all the time, hands, hands, hands. Okay, figure eight drill. Let's go, gentlemen. Here we go. Move, move, hands, hands, good, hands, make it, finish, got the ball, good job, good, faster, faster, good, good, nice job, next group, go Josh, get there, big guys this time, big guys, hands, hands, run it, run it, good job, run it, quick, quick, good, catch, whoa, we got five, we got five, go, move, good, 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 Good. Put her in. Nice job, Michael. Good job, Peter. Good job. Run it. Good. 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 That was a great job, gentlemen. We just missed the layup, though. Good. Run it. Good job, Tyler. Good job, Tyler. Run it. Grab it. Don't miss those layups, Mac. Don't miss those layups. Good. Take her, Juber. Let's go. One more time, buddy. Good. Big guys with the point guard. Big guys with the point guard. Oh, great job, Matt. Nice left-handed layup, buddy. Left, good, good, good.
Okay, the last drill that we want to do we call the marathon. This is the one we end up, the lead up drills to the fast break, break with every day. And uh, it's continuous up and down the floor. And what we do is uh, we'll start out with a 4 one, two layup, coming back 4 one, three layup, then the five will get the layup, then the four will get the layup, then we'll run the secondary break, then we'll come back and run the secondary break. They get a lot of running in, they run their offense, they get in better condition. Kids kind of love it. Uh, they don't like it the first couple of days of practice because they're tired, but after that, then they get used to it, then they're ready to go. Okay, let's go through the marathon, gentlemen. We're gonna do it out of the circle. Let's go, made or miss. All right, up, it's in, good, outlet, good. Four, two, good, layup, grab it, quick, let's go. Out of bounds, quick, get there, get there. Score, up, again, run it. Good, big guy, lay up, run it, quick, quick, there he is, good, lay up, nice job, secondary break guys, secondary break, good, run it, quick, move it, reverse it, reverse it, here he comes, double staggered, there it is, run it again, next one, hurry up, good, outlet, good, run it, quick, Reverse it, good, reverse it, down, double staggered, there he is, good job, next group in. Grab it, good, outlet, lay up Tyler, lay up buddy, good, bring him back, quick, outlet, good, let's go, lay up Murph, good job, let's go again, quick, good, right straight down the middle Case, nice job Casey, good job. Put those in, Patrick, quickly. Run it. There he is. Lay up, Stace. Secondary break, guys. Secondary break. Secondary break. Good. Good. Work. Work. Double staggered for Tyler. Good. There he is. Nice job, Tyler. Good job. Run it. Quick. Move. Get there. Quick. Secondary break. Secondary break. Good. Down, good, run it, good job, good job. One question that you're gonna ask is, yeah, that looks good, but how much time is it gonna take? All right, you're probably looking at about 90 minute practice, maybe two hours, okay? But what we do in our practices, whether it's with the 7th and 8th grade freshmen, sophomores, or the varsity, we'll spend 20 minutes a, a, a day on our fast break system. 10 minutes will be drills, 5 minutes will be the circle drill off the mate or the miss, and 5 minutes will be the secondary break off the mate or miss, and then we'll usually end up with that marathon drill. Now, as I said before, uh, on this fast break system, it's easy to teach. I've done this in three hours with these kids, and a lot of these kids are from different grade schools, so you can teach this coach, and I'm telling you, it's gonna be dynamite. Now, as a junior high coach, one of the things that I always tell my junior high coaches, I want you to stay positive. I don't believe that you can get on the kids. We try to emulate college coaches many times, or maybe even the high school coach that rants and raves at his kids, and I don't think that works in today, with today's kids. I think you have to stay positive all the time, and I think the key is repetition, repetition, repetition. If I can ever help you, uh, basketball's been good to me. 38 years of my life has been spent in basketball, and I love to talk basketball. So if, if you watch this video and you have any questions, just please call me, 608-744-2585. Uh, you can fax me at 608-744-2721, or now I'm going high tech. I've got email, tristate at pcii.net. Hey, I've enjoyed this. I hope you've enjoyed the video.